All right, I'm about to attempt to make something fun. I've never done this before. Um, but I love a Bloody Mary. If you know me, you know that. Like, it's something I'm very, very passionate about is my bloodies or are my bloodies. Uh, but my girl, Brenda Zeno, sent me the most fun idea. She saw it online somewhere and sent it to me. And I'm gonna attempt to make these. Okay, so I've got, they're gonna be Bloody Mary pickle shots. And the actual pickle is gonna be the shot glass. I'm hollowing these out right now. They're kind of a pain to do. But it'll be worth it. If they turn out, they're gonna be really good. Okay, and then I've got my, my favorite Bloody Mix. Madges, I love it. It's fermented, so it's actually healthy to drink. Um, like you can drink these without vodka and, and really it's healthy. Um, vodka just makes it more fun on the weekends when you're not driving, of course. Um, gelatin. I haven't made jello since I was probably seven years old. That was a long time ago. Um, so anyway, you kind of make gel bloody Mary jello and pour it in these and then they sit in the fridge just like jello would. Um, it's a boat weekend around here. It's gonna be a beautiful day today and tomorrow. I wish I would have made these yesterday so we could take them on the boat with us today, but they're gonna have to wait until tomorrow. But how fun for Sunday fun day. All right, I'm gonna try to work on this and let you be a part of it. Um, wish me luck. Okay, I'm gonna share this tool. Several people have asked me to sell Pampered Chef lately in. I love Pampered Chef, but I'm not good at the level marketing stuff. I just, it's just not for me. But I do love their products. I've had many over the years. This is a very cool one. You can hollow out, so I'm going to use it to do my pickles. So you just stick it in there and twist it. Normally you would go all the way through. I do this to cucumbers a lot because I take the seeds out. Um, and then, there you go. Sometimes you do have to pick at the bottom with a, a knife. <clears throat> but if you're going all the way through, it's so easy and it takes the seeds out. And I don't know if you know this, but the seeds are what makes us like burpy, cassy, gross. But the seeds in cucumbers. So if you take um, the seeds out and just eat the, it's not meat, but the, the meat of the cucumber, you won't, it won't make you burp like a typical cucumber does or bloated me and all my knowledge uh okay so i'm gonna have to get more pickles but there's that so, so here's where i am so far i've poured both of my little containers i'm really following the gelatin directions i'm actually following directions i added this just two shots of that or two little tablespoons so that's gonna boil over here and it's boiling quickly and then now it says to put another cup of liquid. And now this cup is going to be vodka. Um, and then I do something with this. Sprinkle over and then let it sit and stir. All right. We'll okay. See. So I think this is all you do. And then you just mix all this together. At least that's what it said. And then that has to cool for just a minute and then I'll fill the pickles and then they go in the fridge to firm up. So stay tuned. Okay, so I've got the pickles filled. I have this handy little ice cube tray. There's the big cubes, we love that. Um, I took the ice out and it's perfect for these pickles because now they have to sit in the fridge and the gelatin has to form. I need more pickles. Look at what a waste that is. Um, but I'll figure something out. Oh, I'll just make jello out of it. Um, that's a good idea. Um, okay, so if these work out, I'm going to be in love and I will be serving them at the door at my Christmas party because of the green and red too is so cute. So how fun. Walk in and take your pickle. Holiday cheer. Um, all right, fingers crossed that they turn out. Look at this. They're 
absolutely perfect. It didn't take as long as I thought to congeal, but they're done. I have not tasted one yet, um, but I'm so excited. I still don't think I'm gonna use them until Sunday because how fun for Sunday fun day. But yay, thanks Brenda. Um, now I'm a professional bloody pickle shot maker because these were so easy and well, I know the mix that's in there and it's always good. So yay, cheers, pickle shots. <laughs>